Hi again and welcome back all of you back to Kenya this week for our next weekly blog update. I'm Robin here with Free the Children in the communities that the one continues to support and specifically I'm in a home right now. I'm in a home of a woman named Mama Chibet who we'll meet in just a moment. But right now within this home, this is where people sit, it's where they sleep, it's where they cook, it's where they entertain their visitors, all within this one room structure. And so as we walk over to the side, we'll meet with Mama Chibet, whose home it is right now. And she's sitting right in front of her stove or her oven. This is my evening with Layani. She says, this is my fire. This is my light. This is my light. And this is called my my kibuyu, or we would call it a Nalgene. It's her water bottle, but they don't use it to carry water. They use it to carry milk for their long safaris or journeys or travels. And so, Mama Chibet, unapika nini hapa? What are you cooking here? She said, I'm cooking lunch for my children, which is a mixture of uh, maize and beans and a dish called githeri. Yeah. But also oh, no. here in Mama Ch oh, she says, take a look at my lunch. <laughs> but as you can notice here, as I sit down with Mama Chabet, mm. since they cook with an open fire, mm. open fire has yeah, a lot of smoke. Yeah. And if you would stay here for just a little bit of time, sitting in this room right here with us, then your mm. eyes would start to swell up with tears because of the way that this poor ventilation has. Mm. As you can see, they get right down into the fire. And in the rainy season, when the wood is wet, it has even more smoke coming out of it. The women, nonetheless, are happy and they enjoy their <coughs> lifestyle. But by simple, small no, changes, as by learning us to have a chimney mm -hmm. to add to this house, or instead of being able to sleep on this, no, we, we this, this mattress of dirt, mm -hmm. but one day being able to afford a bed, yeah. these are things which become possible through the Free the Children alternative income programming mm -hmm. and health programming. So in order to work together with women like Mama Chebets, we all say thank you very much for tuning in. We all want to say a big thank you for joining in with us on this weekly update, for coming to our, her Mama Chabet's home, learning a little bit more about how everybody lives right here in the homestead, and touch base with us again next week where we bring yet another update. Take care.